Polar bears aren't the only animals feeling the devastating effects of climate change. Emperor penguins are fast declining in population too, and a group of scientists is trying to find out if these tuxedoed birds are getting enough to eat. Researchers at the Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution have developed ways to monitor how penguins' diet is changing in the face of climate change, and specifically, melting sea ice. In a new study, the scientists describe how they are using time-lapse videos of penguin colonies to observe their behavior after returning from foraging trips. Emperor penguins tend to be the biggest eaters among the penguin species. They make exceptionally long treks on sea ice to reach their foraging grounds, sometimes up to 75 miles during the winter. But diminishing sea ice is creating two huge obstacles for their foraging journey. The microscopic plankton that live underneath the sea ice and serve as the primary food source for the fish that penguins eat is disappearing. Also, sea ice serves as a resting platform for penguins between their foraging dives. And the more it melts, the harder it is for penguins to be efficient as they hunt for food. Determining foraging success in the face of these obstacles is a two-step process. First, digital photos of the birds are taken every minute using time-lapse cameras that are located near the colony of penguins. This makes it easy to monitor conditions remotely. Once the images are recorded, they're stored in a database to be correlated with sensor-based measurements of air temperature, relative humidity, solar radiation, and wind. This helps the team calculate a perceived penguin temperature, the temperature the penguins are feeling. It's like the wind chill factor for humans. This data, combined with the video observations of when the penguin colonies shift from a scattered liquid-like state to a huddled solid-like state, can help pinpoint changes in their body fat. Since emperor penguins are top predators, their survival is key to the entire polar marine biome. According to a previous WHOI study, emperor penguins are critically endangered, and it's projected that by 2100, the global population will have declined by 20% if heat-trapping gas emissions continue to rise and Antarctic sea ice continues to retreat. The WHOI team hopes that they can apply these observations to derive conservation measures to protect emperor penguins in the long run. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.